What's going on everyone? Welcome to Moonbill Garage. And today, the CNC plasma table gets a high speed, low drag, cool guy tactical torch mount. And everyone knows that every cool guy attachment starts with a Picatinny rail. So when it came to figuring out just how I wanted to mount my plasma torch, I wanted something quick, easy, and adjustable. So that's why I went with the Picatinny rails. So I got a set on Amazon. It's like six different rails, three, three sizes, so two of each. And I just took the mid size and it, it just happened to be pretty much the same height as the plate that I made. So I've already drilled and tapped the holes. So let's get the Picatinny rail mounted. So obviously I don't want to go and over torque those screws since they are just threaded into the plastic plate. Now I could probably, and I may end up getting some longer screws that go all the way through. That way I can put a nut on the back. We'll see how this lasts though. But so far, like I said, as long as you don't over torque it, it should be fine. Now when it comes to actually mounting the torch, I picked up a set, just simple scope mount. Um, I measured the, the uh, head of the torch and it measured 32 millimeter. So I picked up scope mounts that were supposedly 32 millimeter, little small. So I just, what I did was I bolted them together, clamped it together, and then I just put a sanding disc in my drill bit, opened up the opening a little bit. It's still a little small when you attach it, there's still a gap between the, the halves, but it clamps nice and tight and really secures it. And then it's just a matter of sliding this up on the Picatinny rail and tighten it down to where you need it. What I also like about this is if I ever decide to get an actual like machine torch, which are tend to be a lot longer, I can always increase the length of this Picatinny rail and extend it up. And then I can have a clamp here and I have the other clamp still because it is a set that I could put up here and that'll really help to keep that torch head if I ever do go with a machine torch to keep it from racking or anything like that. So this will just be a simple, secure mount for my torch. So there you go, guys. A quick, easy torch mount. Now, there is a little bit of flex in that, and I think that's just because on the back of the Picatinny rail, let me show you here, if it'll focus in on that. There we go. See those little nubs that are standoffs there? I haven't sanded those down. I'll probably... Just go ahead and remove this and sand those down. I think once that's on there, it'll add a little more rigidity to the plastic base plate because that seems to be what's flexing there a little bit. So I'm gonna pull that off and sand it and we'll see if it works. There you can see I sanded those nubs off. I'm gonna reattach it and see if that, uh, see if that did the trick. Now, obviously I need to realign the head to the Picatinny rail to actually be vertical, but for now, just to test this out, this is fine. Yeah, that definitely did uh, take care of, some, there's still some more, still some flex there. That seems to be Yeah, it's definitely in that plate, um, but like I said, I think it'll be fine. If not, we'll address it later. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe, hit the bell, and I'll see you on the next one.